All right, class. Welcome to Zumba 101. Let's get warmed up. Let's follow me. Cupid, a shuffle, a five, six, a five, six, seven, eight. Right, 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 right. right. Yes, Gabby. Well, I have a question. Does the speed of the Earth turning affect the movement of the clouds? Well, actually, Gabby, it's not so much the speed of the Earth turning. It's the upper-level winds, the jet stream. The winds are off. The jet stream, if it's blowing really fast, if it's strong, the speed of the clouds will move faster. And remember, winds are caused by differences in air pressure down by Aruba, Barbados, in summer all year. It's near the equator. The rays are directly all year, directly overhead. So that causes differences in air pressure, high pressure and low pressure. Differences in air pressure cause winds stronger than the jet stream is, the faster the speed of the clouds moves. So not so much the Earth turning, but the winds, how strong the upper level winds, 20 and 40,000 feet below the jet stream. The faster and stronger they're blowing, the uh, faster the clouds are going to move. So the speed of the clouds has to do with the upper level winds. We'll see you next time on Ask Al. I'm going to go back and follow the boss, the director of Zumba. See you next time. Here we go.